So what's happening YouTube, your boy Tektrix back in another video. Today, I'm gonna show you a beautiful device that you can use so that you can track your blood pressure. Here we go. First things first, make sure to hit that subscribe button below, hit that notification bell so you get notified of the next videos to come with tips and tricks and unboxing just like this one. Check out my merch below at 130.ca if you wanna get one of these, I'll link this down below as well. So go ahead and check that out. Make sure to hit that like button so we can beat that YouTube algorithm. So without further ado, let's go ahead and look at this. This one is an automatic upper arm blood pressure monitor. For those of you who needs this a lot, and for those of you who want to track it at home as well, this also can be connected to your smartphone. So today we're gonna test that out and how well it does. So here we go. Here we go. This is a different uh, type of device. I've never unboxed something like this. I'm not a doctor either, so uh, take everything I say with a grain of salt, of course. But today we're gonna review the technology behind this. There you go. Let's go ahead and open up this box right here. Very nice. What we get here is some quick guides and user manuals. Put that on the side for now. Uh, warranty card and the actual device itself there you go very nice let's see what else we get out of this it's also the cable to charge it of course uh, USB-C as well so that's very nice let's put this on the side for now there you go and let's test out this let's check this out there you go as you can see there like a normal um, blood pressure monitor right there. But of course, this one is digital. So right here, we're just gonna download the app. Uh, it's called Vihealth, so go ahead and download that. In. This app is the way that we can track our uh, readings from the Wellu uh, blood pressure monitor. Here you can track the ECG as well, and your blood pressure, of course, that's pretty good. There we go. We're just gonna go with, we're just gonna pair our device as well. Uh, let's turn on our device here. There you go. It's turned on now. It detects that there's the BP2. Let's go ahead and hit that. And we're gonna press both buttons right here, like so. And as you could see, it was able to detect it. Very nice. It also shows the battery up here of the device. There's the ECG part, and then there's the blood pressure data as well. Right there. So it shows you here how it works as well. It's about uh, device properly. Wear the device properly. Click the start button on the device and start measuring. Okay. Let's go ahead and show you that. Okay, now I'll show you guys how it works. Basically, you just put your arm around here, like so. Put it about um, one to two centimeters from there. And then you're just gonna go ahead and wrap that around. And then it sticks with Velcro. Very good. So you're just gonna lay your hand flat there, just relax, and let the monitor read your blood pressure. So let's go ahead and hit start and stop button right here. There we go. It'll start measuring. As you can see there, it'll start to feel that it's compressing inside there. Very nice. There you go. Once it's all done, it'll show you the it'll show you the units there as well. Let's try again because I was talking earlier. So let's try again. Let's one more time. Let's hit start. There you go. It's gonna start measuring.
there you go it shows in the app it'll show you up here as well what what we got it says here that I am uh, 145 over 76 um, the pulse as well it will tell you there uh, 65 uh, per minute 65 beats per minute so that's pretty good so as you can see on the instructions here if you want to test your ECG you're gonna hit this and then if you want to see the history you can hold this for two seconds and then if you want to do your blood pressure you'll hit start and stop so let's go ahead and try the ECG you're just gonna put our palm right here and we're just gonna hit that right there and let's see what what kind of results we get there you go as you can see it's doing the reading now put my palm right against the side of this as you can see there very nice it's going to show you the pulse as well. And there you go. So regular ECG is getting uploaded to our phone now right here. Very nice. The heart rate is 75. As you can see there, you'll be able to see it on our phone and also the monitor right there very nice it says here in instructions well there's different ways to measure your ecg the one we did is the lead one with the hand to hand there's also the right hand to left leg just like that and there's also the lead two like so and then the chest lead right there as you can see here you can also uh put this on your um Apple Health, if you are into that, you can turn that on and then everything will be synced to your Apple Health. There you go. We've done a few tests. So as you can see here, there's three tests that we've done and you could kind of see um, the difference right there. Very nice. And then once you've done more, uh, you've done more tests, it'll show you on the graph as well. So the main features of this device is on the app. Basically, the app is very nice. It shows you the information of each one. You can even change the name of whoever whoever got the test. So, for example, my name is Paul, so I just put Paul on my test. I also wrote a note for myself that this is the initial test. And then you can also it also shows the date on there and the graph of where it lands. So if the normal, I guess is the 120 over 80 if you are against that or if you are you know in the yellow area there then you'll know here i got another test that i'm on the orange it shows you that as well and it also remembers the people that have done it so you can just add more people by just typing a new name and then that'll just be added uh, automatically also you can write any note you want on um, what you want to put there it also everything is all dated and it shows everything on the graph as well it's very nice so if you're someone like me who doesn't really know what's going on and uh, i don't really know what's the standard or why where i should be um, everything should be good here you can also um, share the blood pressure records out of a pdf um, out of the month uh, every day or something like that it'll give you a graph such as this and then you can share it to wherever you want you can put it on your files you can put it on your folder or any drive you want that's pretty cool you could do the exact same thing with ecg as well here as you can see with the ecg you'll see all the uh, graph and you can have it on landscape as well oh, I, I love how you can see all this information right at, right out of the app out of this little monitor um, basically yeah you can you can use this for a lot of things analyze it to however you like that's pretty good. Of course, with the ECG test, you can also change the name to whoever uh, test this is. So I just put my name on here and then you're good to go. And there you have it. I actually like this device and I love how you can use your phone to track everything. Like I said, this is the first time I've tried devices like this and I think it works very well. It shows you all the tests that you have on your phone accessible wherever you go it's very simple design as well so 
again if you guys want to get one yourself so that you'll be able to if you're health concern and also maybe you're working out or something that uh, you need to test your blood pressure and your ECG all the time this is the device for you and that's it for today guys thanks for watching I hope I was able to help you on your choice on a blood pressure monitor and ECG measure monitor as well if you want to get one of these I'll link this down below so go ahead and check that out make sure to hit that subscribe button below so we can see more videos like this if you appreciate what we've done today uh, make sure to hit the like button as well so we can beat that YouTube algorithm I hope you guys have a good day and stay grateful peace